Good morning, Science 9. So I am obviously not here today. So I just want to start off with a um, just a bit of information. When I see you guys next on Tuesday, we're going to be doing a lab, which means any goggles that you may have received either through phys ed or PAA, I need you to bring them. Glasses won't do. I need you to bring goggles for Tuesday and we're going to be in the lab. That being said, your homework that you're taking home for Friday is a WMIS activity. So it's some WMIS training. You have to do that before we go into the lab. So you're going to get a handout at the end of this class for WMIS. And another thing is I'm just going to show you a quick uh, look at the Google Classroom. Okay, so here we are at day two. So everything in day two, you're in class, you're going to do. And then for at home, you have your WMIS activity that will be provided to you. You have this worksheet here, which I've asked, but I've actually just X'd out. So we're not doing this. Ignore this. I'll delete it. But this video here is a really good video on lab techniques and it touches on WMIS a bit. So definitely watch this finish out your um, worksheet and then I'll see you guys on Tuesday and we'll do the lab. So first thing first, you guys are starting off today with a beaker activity. So on Tuesday we talked about pure and impure substances and what you're going to do is there's going to be a bunch of beakers. In fact, there's 10. You're going to take your worksheet that has 10 John beakers on it and you're going to move around from beaker to beaker and fill out the following. So in each beaker you need to decide if there or if it is a pure substance or an impure substance. If it is a pure substance you have to label if it's atoms, if it's a molecule of a diatomic element or if it is a compound. If it's an impure substance, you still have to label if it's an atom, a diatomic element, or a compound. So let's go through um, beaker number nine together. So on your sheet of paper, you can already fill in beaker number nine. Now, when you guys are doing your activity, you are going to have to draw the molecules or atoms yourself, because I get that not all of you guys have colors, you are going to need you're going to need to label the colors as B for black, BL blue, R red, G green, GY gray, white for um sorry, W for white or P for purple. If there's any others I missed, you'll be able to figure it out. Here's beaker 9. It has um two gr or green balls with um one connector. So you would have to draw that out in your beaker. Now my drawing's not going to be very good because I just have my finger. So this is what I would draw out and then I would put G for green. All right, now we need to decide, is this a pure substance? So inside the beaker, does it contain molecules that are exactly the same or is there something different in there? Molecules are exactly the same, this is pure. And the other thing, what kind of molecules are these? So they are the exact same and they're connected. So duos that are connected, these are diatomic elements. Um, I'm going to write that. Diatomic elements. And that would all you, that's all you'd have to do for beaker number nine, and then you would move on to the next beaker until you finished all ten. Good luck.